Hey guys, it's Brittany. Welcome back to my channel. Today, here we are in my kitchen and I'm going to show you a pumpkin cream cheese bread recipe that you can enjoy for breakfast or for dessert. It's perfect for the fall time now that we are in September, just waiting on the cooler weather. So let's go ahead and get started. I will show you the ingredients that you'll need for this recipe along with a cook with me and I'll be sure to show you the final result. Here is the recipe and I will link it down below in the description box as well. You will need the one cup of pumpkin puree filling, make sure it's puree and not pumpkin pie filling, one fourth cup of sour cream, four ounces of cream cheese, two large eggs, three fourths cup of light brown sugar, one cup of all purpose flour, one fourth cup of sugar, one fourth cup of oil, I'm using canola oil, a half teaspoon of baking soda, a half teaspoon of baking powder. You'll need some cooking spray, a nine by five loaf pan, which I have already sprayed with the pan cooking spray. You will need one teaspoon of vanilla extract. I just use the imitation vanilla um, and two mixing bowls and an electric whisk. It doesn't say to use this, but I feel like this might be a little bit easier. And you will need to set your oven to 350 degrees. So we're gonna start off with the um, ingredients to go into the bread portion. We're gonna start off with one cup of the pumpkin puree. One large egg. Three fourths cup of light brown sugar. One fourth cup of canola oil. One fourth cup of sour cream. One teaspoon of vanilla extract. Half tablespoon of pumpkin pie spice. One cup of flour. Half teaspoon of baking powder. Half teaspoon of baking soda. One fourth teaspoon of salt. I'm gonna go ahead and mix that all together. So mix until just combined. Next, we are gonna start on the cream cheese filling. So we have four ounces of cream cheese one egg, one fourth cup of sugar, and then you'll need to add three tablespoons of flour. No. 
and then go ahead and whisk it until it's combined and smooth. Whisk it until it's smooth looking like this. Now you're gonna grab your loaf pan, again, that needed to be sprayed with cooking spray, and pour two thirds of the pumpkin bread filling into the loaf pan. Spreading it around evenly. And I'm kinda just eyeballing the two thirds Next, pour the cream cheese filling on top of the two thirds that's in the loaf pan, spreading evenly. Now you're gonna take the rest of the pumpkin bread filling, pour it on top, spreading it evenly. And this is how it should look once it's in the pan and it is going to go into the oven at 350 degrees for 45 to 50 minutes. All right guys, so the pumpkin bread is done. It cooked for 50 minutes, again at 350 degrees. I have left it cooling for 15 minutes um, in the pan and I'm going to go ahead and take it out of the pan and slice it up. So here is the final product. It looks amazing. The house smells amazing. And the family is about to come give it a taste. Thank you guys so much for joining me on today's video. And if you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And again, I'll leave the recipe down below. So leave a comment if you guys have tried it and if you liked it. Here we have Ronan who is going to taste the cream cheese pumpkin bread. Go ahead and try it. Mm, this is really good. Is it good? Mm-hmm. You guys should try this. Mm.